everyone welcome to my youtube channel ncrt maths hub today in this video we will do worksheet number 46 for class 9 subject mathematics so in this video we are going to learn about the surface area of sphere and hemisphere so required previous knowledge is understanding of sphere and surface area so children in the adjacent figure you can see sphere and the some objects which are in the shape of sphere the surface of sphere is made up of only one curved face the surface area of sphere is equals to the sum of area of four circles having radius same as that of sphere so we will get surface area of sphere equals to 4 pi r square that is 4 into area of each circle that is pi r square so 4 into pi r square will be the surface area of sphere where r is the radius of sphere so now example number one the surface area of sphere having radius 4 centimeter will be equals to sa equals to 4 pi r square here it is 4 pi is 22 by 7 and radius is 14 so 14 into 14 so after simplifying you will get 2464 centimeter square that is the surface area of hemi uh, sphere so now let's take a solid sphere and slice it through the middle means we will cut the middle with the help of parallel plane that passes through the center the sphere gets divided into two equal parts sphere kya hoga do bhagon mein bat jayega do equal parts mein divide ho jayega and each of these equal part is called as hemisphere each equal part ko hum kya bolenge hemisphere so yaad rakhiye half ke liye hum kya bolenge hemisphere half of the sphere will be called as hemisphere and half of the circle will be called as semicircle keep in mind so now is hemisphere has two faces one is curved face and other is flat face you can see here this is curved face and this is flat face that is top of hemisphere that is circular shape so now the lateral surface area of hemisphere or you can say curved surface area of hemisphere will be the half of the surface area of sphere that will be equals to 2 pi r square means some can say lateral surface area of hemisphere equals to curved surface area of hemisphere equals to 2 pi r square where r is the radius of sphere taking both the faces of hemisphere that is total surface area will be equals to 2 pi r square plus pi r square and pi r square is the area of flat surface that is circle so 2 pi r square plus pi r square will be 3 pi r square and this is the total surface area of hemisphere so now lateral surface area of hemisphere of radius 14 centimeter will be equals to lsa equals to 2 pi r square so put all the values here and after simplifying you will get lateral surface area or you can say curved surface area equals to 1232 centimeter square and now total surface area of hemisphere of radius 14 centimeter will be equals to 3 pi r square put all the values here and you will get 1848 centimeter square so now in example number two a hemispherical ball is made up of steel 0 0.25 centimeter thick the inner radius of ball is 5 centimeter find the inner curved surface area ball outer curved surface area ball and the total surface area ball use pi as 3.14 so now inner curved surface area of hemispherical ball will be 2 pi r square put all the values here and you will get 157 centimeter square and outer curved surface area of hemisphere ball will be 2 pi r square that is inner radius plus thickness so this will be here radius will be 5.25 so 2 into pi 3.14 into r that is 5.25 r square due to r square this will be 5.25 into 5.25 after simplifying you will get 173.09 centimeter square so this is the outer curved surface area so now total surface area of hemispheric spherical ball will be inner curved surface area plus outer curved surface area plus surface area of ring that is the top face so you can see here now we see that we have a larger circle and a smaller circle hai. so the area of difference of these two circles will be the area of ring that is pi into capital R square minus small r square so after putting all the values here we will get 338.14 cm square that is the total surface area of hemispherical ball so now we have four questions for practice so let's move ahead for solution so question number one is find the surface area of sphere of radius 21 cm so first question we have given radius that is 21 cm we need to find the surface area of sphere so given radius of sphere is 21 cm so that surface area of sphere will be 4 pi r square so 4 pi is 22 by 7 and r square will be 21 into 21 so after simplifying you will get 88 into 63 that is 5544 cm square so now question number 2 find the curved surface area and the total surface area of hemisphere of radius 21 centimeter so what we have given is hemisphere given this is the radius 21 centimeter so we are given the radius of hemisphere that is 21 centimeter so we need to find the curved surface area and you know curved surface area or you can say lateral surface area of hemisphere 2 pi r square so the 2 pi r square 
will be 2 into pi that is 22 by 7 and r square will be 21 into 21 so after simplifying you will get 2772 centimeter square as the curved surface area or you can say lateral surface area of hemisphere so now we need to find the total surface area of hemisphere that is 3 pi r square put all the values here so 3 into pi 22 by 7 and r square will be 21 into 21 and after simplifying you will get 66 into 63 and that is 4158 centimeter square is the total surface area of hemisphere so now proceed for question number three find the radius of a sphere whose surface area is 154 centimeter square so the kya kya given hai hame radius of sphere find out karna hai aur hame given kya surface area of uh, sphere given hai so that we are given we can write it as surface area of sphere that is 154 centimeter let us assume that radius of sphere is r centimeter or you can say r unit so surface area of sphere will be 4 pi r square square unit so this is surface area of sphere and this is also surface area of sphere that is given so we can equate these two so 4 pi r square equals to 154 so 4 pi is 22 by 7 and r square equals to 154 so r square will be equals to 154 into 1 by 4 into 7 by 22 so now r square will be equals to you can see here 7 into 7 upon 2 into 2 so r will be equals to under the root 7 into 7 upon 2 into 2 and here this will be 7 by 2 and this will be 3.5 centimeter so radius of sphere will be equals to 3.5 centimeter so now proceed for question number 4 that is a right circular cylinder of radius r equals to 7 centimeter just encloses a sphere and find the surface area of sphere and curved surface area of cylinder. So, first of all, let's understand the statement. What is a right circular cylinder? What does it do? It touches the sphere ko completely. Cover karta hai. Just apka, jo ap, upper apka end of the circular ka base, your circular base and circular top is touching the sphere. Ko. Aur iska radius, mein circular cylinder ka radius is 7 cm. So, that you can see the radius of the cylinder is the radius of the sphere. Ka ho and we need to find the surface area of sphere hame surface area of sphere find out karna hai aur curved surface area of cylinder find out karna hai so dekhiye height of cylinder kya ho jayegi dekhiye radius ka double ho jayega that is height of cylinder hame height of cylinder kya milegi height of cylinder milegi equals to 2r yani radius ka double milega that is equals to diameter of sphere yeah, you can say diameter of sphere will be the height of cylinder so now as the right circular cylinder just encloses the sphere that's why right radius of cylinder equals to radius of sphere equals to 7 cm dono ka radius kya hoga same hoga so now height of cylinder that is equals to h equals to kya hoga radius ka double that is equals to diameter so 2 into 7 that is equals to 14 cm hame height mil jati hai 14 cm so now surface area of sphere will be equals to 4 pi r square put all the values here 4 into pi 22 by 7 and radius square becomes 7 into 7 so after simplifying you will get 28 into 22 equals to 616 cm square this is the surface area of sphere so now in the second part we need to find the curved surface area of cylinder that is 2 pi r h so 2 into pi 22 by 7 radius is 7 and height is 14 so after simplifying you will get 28 into 22 equals to 616 centimeter square so that we can say surface area of sphere equals to curved surface area of cylinder equals to 616 centimeter square so this is all about worksheet number 46 so if you learn from this video then please do subscribe my channel and share this video as much as you can thanks for watching